So I'm just looking for something that would indicate that you would give a worker a fair shot. Maybe it's in your background somewhere that I don't know about, but I'd like to have you respond to it any way you can. Senator, I really appreciate that. I think there is a way you can take a look at this question without me potentially prejudging a case. And I appreciate your respect for that. And, and just, just to finish that thought, I'm concerned that I have to look the litigant in the eye in the next case. And if I've prejudged that case, they can look at me and say, you're not a fair judge. And I've got no answer for that. I've got no answer for that. So what, what I think can give you comfort in this area is, Senator, I, I know a case or two has been mentioned yesterday, respectfully. I'd suggest that does not represent the body of I've written 2,700, I've participated in 2,700 opinions over 10 and a half years. And if you want cases where I've ruled for the little guy as well as the big guy, there are plenty of them, Senator. The, the Ute Indian tribe. Would you be willing to submit some of them? Oh, it's hard goodness. to read 2,700 cases. I'll, I'll, I'll name a I bunch of them right now. I'm on Trans Am. I'm, I'm sorry, Senator. Of course, uh, Ute 5 and 6, Fletcher, the Rocky Flats case, which vindicated the rights of people who had been subject to pollution by large companies in Colorado, uranium pollution. Um, <clears throat> I, I point you to the magnesium case, similar pollution case in the Salt Lake, in the Salt Lake City area. Uh, Colorado's effort with renewable energy upheld that. Or versus City of Albuquerque, involving uh, pregnancy discrimination in the police department in Albuquerque. WD Sports, a disc discrimination claim. Casey, Energy West, Crane. Simpson versus CU, involving young women who had been harassed by the football team. Um, AM, versus, a a AM, Browder, Sutton. I, I can give That's you a helpful. long, long That's list. And, and we'll find them and we'll read them. And, and, and Senator, the bottom line, I think, is that I'd like to convey to you from the bottom of my heart is that I'm a fair judge. And I think if you ask people in the Tenth Circuit, is he a fair judge? You're going to get the answer that you got yesterday from both Senator Bennett and Senator Gardner and from General Cottrell. And the same answer you got from Senator Allard and Senator Salazar 10 years ago. And Senator, I can't guarantee you more than that, but I can promise you absolutely nothing.